Yo, what's going on everyone? Welcome back. Today is two days before Riverside, it's Thursday. I'm hosting a pop-up meet tonight. Um, Justin just pulled up to the crib. How long was the drive? Well, it should have been like 13, but the Miata broke down, so that was the whole thing. Yeah. 24 hours? <laughs> <laughs> that was last day later. Yeah, but uh, I am getting ready to take this pile of shit downtown really not excited about the drive but um, I'm debating putting the green panels on the side ever since I've had the car back I haven't even like put them on there I know they're gonna look ridiculous but I might just do it because people will be like oh so the green panels do fit and everyone's gonna be like what the fuck what was the deal with that and the whole story actually with the green panels I know when I picked up the car and the whole if you haven't seen the video of me picking up the car and the whole debacle of it not being painted, blah, 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 go watch that. But the green panels threw me for a loop because I was like, nothing about the car was supposed to be green. And the one thing that got painted was these panels on the side. Um, they were actually mistaken for another car's panels and painted by accident, supposedly. Yeah, kind of weird. But anyway, I'm going to slap those on. Dude. That's like the second time that's happened too. Really? Yeah, dude, we went through a drive through in the Crown Majesta yeah. and uh, I was in the back of it and I was ordering like super British accent, all that shit. And yeah. I was like, hold on, let me see what my driver wants. The dude's like, wait, you got a driver? And then we pull up to the window and they're like looking at it and they're like, must be one of those European cars and <laughs> shit. Can I do the small burger? with just cheese, ketchup, and mustard. And then let me do some white cheddar cheese bites. Some nuggets, please. Yes, sir, what's the drink on that box? Uh, just a Coke. And then, hold on, let me see what my driver wants. <laughs> yes, sir. Can't get that fucking nut back on there. Whatever, I'm just not opening this door. What have you done to the front of my car? Uh, it's a Euro car, so... I to put it... <laughs> <laughs> that is definitely off of a Sprinter van, that's huge. That's balling. I, okay. It might have been off a Sprinter van or like a GL or something. There weren't many Sprinter vans that came from the car Thank wash, you guys. So. Why is everyone always doing that to me? Dude, that shit is... <laughs> kind of, it's kind of hard. I can pay for Mercedes LS400. <laughs> All right, we are about to head downtown. Uh, this will be the first venture for this thing to go down there. Uh, I, oh yeah, I haven't pointed this out. I had to take my corner light out because I broke the tab on it the other day and I literally just hit a bump and ripped it straight out. So I'm not trying to lose really expensive corner lights even though it's broken. Um, but yeah, that Mercedes badge is, is killing me. Had to manage my reactions, basic laws of attraction. Hella cautious, hella savage, huh? Navigating through this madness, keep on flowing, can't be stagnant. High achiever, he not average. With due respect, it ain't no challenge, but I used to pick up a little red and a lesson for us to my life. Consider it's pivotal, trap through the app, make her clap it, don't cap it, she tapping it fast. I think that she know they be catching it. Standing six feet up, casting a shadow while niggas that talk like they bad it. They know that we got it, they talk far from actual. I make the way so tsunami, I dare you to paddle in. The trunk steady rattling. Blowing top tier to keep my thoughts clear. I see the optim fear, I'm on my shot, call a big bar shit. I never know the time, I'm never clocking in. Wildflower, I'm like Denzel, I've been the men on fire, bitch. I'm hot lava, you are not scarlet, you are proud, proudly. I'm a real nigga to the cuff still. Heart chill from all this talking real. Recent life feel like a highlight reel. Currently thumbing through currency, I'm from the avenue, bitch, I'ma get it regardless I tell little baby to slide with that lotus, pull up with the garden, my guard is down Till you come around, trying to hold you some, give a fuck how you feel, I don't owe you nothing Now you trying to make amends, I'm just trying to get the fortunes Trying to cut my mama fortress, pop my pull up in a Porsche I used to be quiet, I was timid, they used to catch me skipping courses Now they snap a nigga portrait, hard head but never forced it I got a pen it shine like it's supposed to, the way I deliver they post to My neck got a compass to know where we gone, it sound like I'm stepping through Portals. I'm off of that poison, the devil be calling, but I just ignored it for it. The task force told me, God, 
Okay, okay, yeah, you asked for it. Wait, the task force told me go. Okay, okay, yeah, you asked for it. Wait, the task force told me go. Look. The way that I ball, I should've paid for the Big Ten When I touch stage, but they packed in Got a pretty thing to make a back bend Let me see it all through the glass lens Had some people try to snake if I see you I'm teed up, I greet you with brass hands Skate off fast, put a buck on the dash And somewhere fast, with my feet up Wait, hold up the label, just call me the tapping They just cut the check, so I'm up in a slip I take for J to the neck, then I stretch To start my day, I hit the cash dance Niggas is different now, I was down then But that's all in the past tense So I can't stop shit until I'm top ten And I'm not ten, I'm so in love with the process Not all in the day, but a Took him some time to build wrong. I just caught the crib, never home. No, I can't keep a charge on the phone. So she thinks she in love with a ghost. When I'm home, I make sure that she get what she needs so she know what I'm capable of. Know my rhythm, cause spot with the pros. They pay me to hear what I'm on, to ask what I'm on. I'm doing great, I suppose. Cause I get to do what I want to do. Mercedes logo to put on the front of the crown. Dude, we actually should. I'll, uh, I'll call the local car wash to see if they have <laughs> any in stock. <laughs> Made it downtown. I'm a little bit shaky and anxious because it was horrible. Mason just ate shit. Hey, man, it sucks <laughs> nobody parks so shitty Camry behind your car. Dude. I know. Did, you, did you see the soccer mom? I got <laughs> well, I guess not soccer mom. It would be her mom. <laughs> man. We're out here at the Obsess Worldwide 90s only meet. I'm actually really stoked about this because... Mm. The owner of Obsessed Worldwide. Let me just show you his car real quick because it's fucking ridiculous. Fuck. This thing's fucking cool. This is uh, Ben's Orthia. It's a Honda Orthia. And I think he just added these graphics down the side we're like 80s or 90s uh i don't know like the styrofoam cup type things I, i'm a big fan of that it's kind of that jet ski type thing yeah bud yeah taking some scriptures the scriptures the <laughs> dang just a good e46 on workmeisters that is Fire. This is Mason's right hand drive E36. Just got finished up. What'd you do to it? Uh, coil over its wheels, five speed swap, put some Recaros in it, put a Japanese uh, Tokyo Horn RD in it, front lip, and then shout out Aiden, Pank corrected it. Which the video is maybe up on his channel? I'll yeah, he'll, put, channel. he'll put it up on his channel. So yeah, it came fun. out tight. It's real simple, real fun. I'm excited about it. This is so dope, bro. How long have you had this car? Four years coming up. It's been, the, the past two years has been like the whole process of me cutting it up, high radius, stubbing it, raising the subframes, all that stuff. So it's been an ongoing project. I'm excited right now because I actually get to like drive it and experience what I've thrown together. Yeah. That bump looks horrible. I can't believe you're static. <laughs> it doesn't doesn't scrape unless it's like the crown of the road or yep. something really bad. Right here it's gonna scrape. <laughs> really not that bad. So a lot of stress before the show. Trying to get stuff together last second. My uh, supplier thankfully is local, but uh, all of my stuff is getting printed like today. So I have to go pick it up here in a little bit, hopefully. I mean, it'll drive it, but it, yeah, won't yeah. Be, it will not be very bad. You go across the crown of the road like that, it's bad. <laughs> I have a pretty good gauge by now as to what things will like be really bad and what won't. Yeah, Let's see, my 360 is stock height. Mm -hmm. I need to lower it, but I'm, uh, I'm, I'm honestly scared. Does it not have kidding. factory coolers? It does. So See, I was talking to somebody about that the other day. I, I got a friend that picked up a 360 recently. Oh, yeah? And I was I was like, what? Uh, what's available for suspension? He was like, it's stock cooler. I was like, what? Yep. Yeah, it's nice that this thing doesn't, like, scrape all the time. I hate, like, it drawing unnecessary attention. It's the worst. 
like that it's somewhat inconspicuous, or it will be when it's made. Have you seen your Fitment? <laughs> inconspicuous? It's from Europe. Hey, it's a big body fan, bro. Jeez. So, some time has passed. We just made it over to this spot, which if you saw our video where we did the tour of photo shoot spots, this is my pre-pre-meet location. Oh my God, I did leg day today and this hurts. But yeah, this is a fucking cool spot. We've got the cars like centered up right there. And then whenever people show up, we'll figure it out. I don't know if we can park in this lot or not 100%, but I'm really excited. I've been enjoying driving my car, even though it's been horrible on these roads. Like I have smacked it off of so much shit, but it's taken it, so yeah. Oh, and, and I just picked up the jackets and the shirts for Riverside. I'm so excited, I gotta show you them a little bit. Hell yeah. Got both my shit boxes in one place. That looks cool as fuck. Just got the jackets, fresh off the press today. Not the press, the screen. But so stoked. I, I've always wanted to do like a globe type design. I'm glad I can find like, these. And this is like the last drop ever for LEP. You can only get these at Riverside, so when you're watching this video, it's too late. I'll show you anyway. Community, no competition. Big thing with Riverside, they don't do trophies. It's really just like a cool grassroots style meet where everybody comes and hangs out. It's not about competing for who has the best fucking car, best crew, whatever. It's just a bunch of homies with nice cars hanging out. And so, yeah, I wanted to make this Riverside jacket encompass that. Big stoke. And I need to put one of the shirts out, which I'll do that. So, yeah, tan windbreakers. If there's any left, which I doubt there is, you can get them on the website now. But they may already be gone. Bunch of cars rolling into this spot now. A couple cars I'm really fucking excited about. If you guys remember from last year in Nashville, I uh, showed you guys this badass Y32 SEMA. Well, it's had some changes, like very recently. It is now high radius, flared, has vented fenders. It is really dirty, because how far did you just drive? Like 11 hours, 700 miles. Straight here. So it's filthy, but Oh. It came out the Sunday. Yes, it did. Oh my fucking god. It is so good. So we got a pretty fucking sick lineup here now. Still early. This thing, I gotta talk about this thing. I've been talking forever to, to JR, who owns this car, about how he needs to match my white silver two-tone. And finally, I got him to do it. And I'm so fucking pumped about it. And he decided to tuck now instead of go fend the lip, so. Big, big fan. Fuck. I'm so excited for this weekend. So many ridiculously sick really cars here. You tell my car was Every year, I feel like there's gonna be more and more crazy VIP cars. If you have a VIP car, come to Riverside. I have been waiting so long to see this car. Dude. That is ridiculous. Yeah, this shit's pretty cool. The fuck is this and guy? That's my barber it's with his heat. <laughs> it is me. Dude, look at your hair with this light right now is absolute guys. Yeah, it do. Holy it's fuck. Really nice. Stop, bro. My girl's gonna watch this video. <laughs> <laughs> that fucking sunset. Bussy, dude. We actually had to move because that area is designated for buses and handicap parking. Uh, the guy from whatever parking company owns this was really cool. Thankfully, he was super nice and we were respectful back. It's always a big thing. If people do ask you to move on, just be respectful and do what they say. Like, at the end of the day, you're in the wrong. So we moved over here, which is the parking lot next to it. Just pay to park and you're good. <laughs> All right, we just got done eating dinner, hanging out, and I, of course, had to pull up to the same spot that I do every single year that I've had this car here. Fucking, I'm bummed because it's obviously not done, and it would be really nice if it could go from like the first phase of the car to the second phase to then this phase, but I'm in an in-between state, 
stage phase right now. Um, and of course the fucking Mercedes badge. <laughs> I keep forgetting it's there. Um, but I'm gonna take the same picture, edit it the same, and that's just cool. Shout out to my boy Q for pulling up. My dude right there. Make me look bad. <laughs> <laughs> fucking half finished and shit. Meanwhile, mm, I gotta walk you guys around this thing because it's fucking ridiculous. This is where the car's staying for the night. I don't feel like driving it home. It's fucking raining too, so. Yeah, this shit looks fucking fire. Honestly, this is like a perfect time to like compare side to side. Like how much, you got a lot more girth than me. Yeah, I got like. But I got, I got tilts. 12 wide. Good, dude, look at your rear arch. That shit's fucking so big. Oh, I'm glad you like it. <laughs> <laughs> now nah, that's just cool to see like different styles or different takes on the same chassis. Like, they're both pretty close to the same height, honestly. That's wild. Yeah, they look like two completely different cars. It does. Well, yeah, mine's a Mercedes, obviously. Yeah, yeah, my bad. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, that shit gets me every time. Being here for a couple years longer than Liam, I have seen the roads and how bad they can be, and... I was like, this that car is never gonna get anywhere downtown ever. <laughs> but I mean, even some of the sketchiest parts where I was like, he would definitely get stuck or he would definitely fuck his car up. He just gotta send it. We're on our way home now. I have a few hundred shirts and jackets to fold, which is gonna be wonderful, but thankfully it's only 11.30, which is great. And I'm gonna try and get up early and get back down here and see people. All right, guys, I am about to unbox all of this stuff. It is 12.30 right now, doing stuff until 3 a.m. and then having to leave at like six, you know, four or five, whatever. I have a lot of stuff to fold. I'm gonna get to that. I do wanna get more sleep so that I can enjoy myself. But today was a fucking blast. It's the first time in two years I've gotten to drive my car around, just listen to music and <sighs> I didn't really film that much and I apologize, but it's mainly because that was me just living and enjoying that moment for myself. Like it has been, this camera's heavy as fuck. Give me one second. It has been years since I've had like that release. And for any of you guys that like go through shittier stuff and can relate to this, we have like a connection with our cars and you have that release, you can go out, go for a drive, just cruise around, listen to music, whatever it is that helps you like decompress and relax. Imagine that you don't have that anymore. And a lot of people go through this. I know Matt goes through it because his, his whole thing with his Crown Majesta. That connection that you have and that release, like losing that, it sucks. And for the past two years that my car has been down and I've been working on it, it's been great because I've been able to like see it come together and do everything myself, but just being able to go out and go for a cruise, I, I've not been able to do that in such a long time. And so today was like the first time in two years, I literally just got to have that release again and it felt fucking amazing. <sighs> this is why I was dying to fucking drive the car around Riverside weekend. I didn't care to like take it to the show. I don't really care for it to be a me. I don't care who sees it. I just want to like drive around with my friends and listen to music. And it felt so good to do that. And I will probably do that a bunch tomorrow. <sighs> Anyways, guys, I appreciate you for watching. This was a good day and I'm really excited about tomorrow. And you know, if you guys haven't been to Riverside yet, you need to come to Riverside because all the things that I'm expressing in this video are accurate. Thank you guys. If there is anything left over from Riverside, it'll be on the website now, but once it's gone, it's gone. No more LEP drops. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again tomorrow.